Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to do a clean Windows 10 installation with the free Windows 10 upgrade. However, there's a small catch. You need to do an in-place installation of Windows 10 first. So, you, let's say you have a Windows 7, Windows 8 or Windows 8.1 computer. It is fully activated and you have registered the free Windows 10 upgrade. You need to do the normal Windows 10 upgrade first from within your operating system and then have a activated Windows 10 before you can do the clean install. It won't work otherwise because your computer needs to be activated and registered with Microsoft. It'll do that online. There won't be a license key. So that's something you need to do first. I've done a video. I'll put it in the description that shows you how to do the Windows 10 in place uh, installation using the media creation tool. So we use the same media creation tool again. So if you've done a USB stick or a DVD already, you can reuse this for this process. So basically you restart your computer and you boot from either the USB or from the DVD media. You might have to press down certain keys on my computer I had to press the escape key on your computer might be F12 or delete or one of the other keys and the only other thing you need to take into account when you're installing uh, when you do a clean install is don't type in the license key always press the skip button you get asked twice and in both instances do not enter a license key and I will time lapse the video and towards the end I'll show you that Windows 10 uh, is successfully act activated without having to enter a license key. So uh, Microsoft must be using some uh, information about your computer hardware, maybe what motherboard or what network card you've got, and it uses that to activate. And the benefit of a clean install is that you can uh, delete all the partitions and start from scratch. So virtually there are no, there's no baggage, there are no driver issues with previous software and so on. So if you want to start from scratch, or if you had a virus and you don't want to go back to Windows 7 and then do the upgrade to 10, you want to go straight clean to Windows 10, then this video is for you. There's not much else to say, so thanks for watching and any comments, leave them down below. Hit that like button and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so. And as always, looking forward to seeing you in one of my upcoming next videos.